Hello everyone, welcome to this very special reading, which is going to be packed full of opportunities and pointers for healing separation consciousness. And when that's cleared, everything can snap back into its natural place, union, because union and true love is your natural state. That's why it feels so normal and peaceful. Separation is unnatural and abnormal, which is why it feels bad. So, on that note, let's see what we have. We have reach out. You're very strong and capable, but it's perfectly okay to ask for help where required. Claim your support where needed. You don't need to struggle along doing your best and not getting quite the results that you want. You're never alone on this journey. It's an illusion if you feel alone. You don't have to do anything all by yourself. You can try going solo, but your desires will happen sooner and more gracefully with the help of others. And there is great healing happening at the moment. Know that you can heal anything. You don't need your twin flame even around you to take the steps that you need to take at this time. Sure, claim support as much as you need, but it's also easy to just love yourself. Easy to just be with yourself, even if you're resisting. Ask yourself, why am I resisting love here? Maybe I need something else here. You're building that relationship with the divine and yourself and your twin flame within. Building trust, building communication, showing up for yourself. It's safe for you to learn that process really thoroughly. We learn how to love ourselves unconditionally. When we say you're allowed to have any feeling arise, good or bad, we're saying to ourselves, I will love you no matter what. Give yourself unconditional love. Choose to be your own best friend and promise to show up for yourself no matter what you feel because you know how to help yourself heal. Know your dreams with understanding. Remember, your desires in your heart were placed there by the divine so that it may come true. Not to frustrate you or thwart you, but so you, you can have them. They choose to receive all of your desires. Bring yourself everything you need to feel all the love that you've been calling in. Be your own best friend once again. And your twin flame can show up as your best friend. You deserve to be loved. You're not alone. You never were. Allow yourself to feel greatness and kindness, sweetness and safety, validation. You're worth loving. You always were. Separation is just a nightmare that you're lifting yourself out, out of. When you heal, it goes. It leaves. You are not your experiences. You're not defined by what you went through. You were always a divine being, a divine child of the universe. Recognize that you can never be harmed in truth. You're eternal. Dedicated effort. Dedication, that's what you need. You've shown you've got what it takes and that you're dedicated. Through your life's experiences, you've learned some valuable skills. Use the tools that you have to continue to nurture your relationships with yourself and the divine first by default your twin flame and all your relationships will be transformed as a result especially when situations have been difficult but you have the integrity and courage to continue healing and improving in this area of relationships so that you step fully into the area of divine relationship Third eye chakra, pineal perspective. So your vision is expanding as well. You're being you're you're able to see much more clearly now that how safe you are with the divine, reclaiming yourself, lifting <clears throat> yourself out of the nightmare 
of separation because you're better able to see the truth of your union more and more. If you're not quite there yet, it's okay. Keep going. The clarity will come. Coming back into oneness. It's safe to be vulnerable. Know that you're strong. You have the divine. You can't be harmed. You are just love. Claim your innocence. Perhaps we didn't know who we were before and we had a really bad time, but luckily, this is the way out. You must have earned that. Remember, you must have loved very, very much to be able to be ascending here and now. You deserve all of that love, all of that healing, all of that safety and protection. Let love grow. You know how you feel. We cycle around until we bring love to that part of us that's really craving, recognising there's an area that's really wanting to be loved. You can do that. You're so powerful. You're so connected to love. And you're learning how to show up for yourself. And it's okay not to be sure. It's okay to not quite get it. Because in each place in consciousness that still feels separate from love, you have to re-choose love there. It's like we walk into a place of forgetfulness and one must remember that they are divine, that separation was all a bad dream, that you were safe all along. Healing can be easy and straightforward. It can take a little while to get there and it's, it's okay. You do get there. Remember, the relationship you're building isn't even with the twin flame primarily. It's with you. Validate yourself. Your feelings are real. They are true. Even the ones that don't feel good, they're a call for love. And you deserve to go running to yourself every time. Be, being there for yourself and choosing to love yourself without conditions. Choosing to show up for yourself no matter what you're feeling. Choose to hold yourself and bring love there. That's all you need to do. And on that note, I'm going to end this message. Hope it was helpful. See you soon.